The story of human evolution is a tapestry woven with the threads of countless species, each contributing to the rich mosaic of our past. As Homo sapiens, the species we belong to, emerged and spread across the Earth, it encountered a variety of other humanoids. These encounters were pivotal in shaping the course of human history and evolution. This narrative will explore the rise of Homo sapiens and its interactions with six ancient species of humanoids, leading to the eventual dominance of Homo sapiens and the extinction of its cousins. Neanderthals, Homo neanderthalensis. One of the most well-known cousins of modern humans, the Neanderthals, roamed Eurasia from approximately 400,000 to 40,000 years ago. Neanderthals were adapted to the cold climates of Ice Age Europe with a robust build and features that helped them survive in harsh conditions. They were skilled hunters, capable of crafting sophisticated tools, and they even exhibited signs of cultural practices, such as burying their dead. The interaction between Homo sapiens and Neanderthals was complex, involving both competition and cooperation. Genetic evidence suggests interbreeding occurred between the two species, indicating that they coexisted and interacted closely. However, the exact reasons for the Neanderthals' extinction are still debated, with factors such as climate change, competition for resources, and disease possibly playing roles. Nonetheless, the legacy of the Neanderthals lives on, with a small percentage of their DNA present in non-African modern humans. Denisovans, Homo Denisova Less is known about the Denisovans than about the Neanderthals, but they are another extinct species of the genus Homo that lived in Asia. The Denisovans are known primarily through genetic evidence found in a few fossils from Siberia and Tibet. Like the Neanderthals, they interbred with Homo sapiens, as well as with Neanderthals, leaving a genetic legacy in modern humans, especially among indigenous populations in Asia and Oceania. The Denisovans possessed unique genetic traits, some of which have been beneficial for modern humans, such as adaptations to high altitudes. The extinction of the Denisovans, similar to that of the Neanderthals, is believed to have been caused by a combination of environmental changes and competition with Homo sapiens. Homo floresiensis, nicknamed the Hobbit for its small stature, Homo floresiensis inhabited the island of Flores in Indonesia until as recently as 50,000 years ago. This species is remarkable for its small body and brain size, features that may have evolved due to the phenomenon of island dwarfism. The discovery of Homo floresiensis challenged previous notions of human evolution, illustrating the complexity and diversity of human species. The exact relationship between Homo floresiensis and modern humans is still unclear, including whether direct contact ever occurred. However, the presence of Homo sapiens in the region coincides with the time frame of the extinction of Homo floresiensis, suggesting competition for resources may have played a role in their demise. Homo luzonensis Discovered in the Philippines, Homo luzonensis is a recently identified species that lived approximately 67,000 years ago. Similar to Homo floresiensis, Homo luzonensis exhibits a mix of ancient and modern traits, including small teeth and curved toes suitable for climbing. The discovery of Homo luzonensis adds to the evidence that Southeast Asia was a hotspot of human diversity. The interactions between Homo luzonensis and Homo sapiens are yet to be fully understood, but as with other humanoid species, it's plausible that competition and environmental changes contributed to their extinction. Homo naledi. Found in South Africa, Homo naledi is another fascinating member of our family tree. Dated to around 300,000 to 200,000 years ago, Homo naledi had a small brain but exhibited some surprisingly human-like behaviors, such as the possible intentional burial of their dead. The coexistence of Homo naledi with Homo sapiens and other human species in Africa adds another layer of complexity to our evolutionary history. The exact nature of their relationship and the reasons for Homo naledi's extinction remain topics of ongoing research. Neanderthal-Denisovan hybrids 
Recent genetic studies have revealed evidence of a hybrid population resulting from the interbreeding of Neanderthals and Denisovans. This discovery underscores the interconnectedness of ancient human species and challenges the notion of a clear lineage leading to modern humans. These hybrids contributed to the genetic makeup of present-day humans, further blurring the lines between different species. As Homo sapiens ventured out of Africa and into new territories, they encountered various other human species. Each of these encounters marked a turning point, not only in the history of Homo sapiens, but also in the destinies of these ancient cousins. The gradual disappearance of these other species, coinciding with the rise of Homo sapiens, suggests that our ancestors played a significant role in their extinction. This section explores the mechanisms through which Homo sapiens may have contributed to the demise of these six species. Competition for resources. The most direct impact Homo sapiens had on their ancient cousins was through competition for resources. As skilled hunters and gatherers, Homo sapiens exploited the environment in efficient ways, which likely put pressure on the resources available to other species. In regions where their habitats overlapped, Homo sapiens and other humanoids would have competed for food, water, and shelter. Over time, this competition could have led to the depletion of essential resources for other species, contributing to their decline and eventual extinction. Cognitive and Technological Advantages The cognitive and technological advances of Homo sapiens likely gave them a competitive edge over other species. The development of more sophisticated tools, art and culture, as well as the ability to adapt to a wide range of environments, may have contributed to Homo sapiens' dominance. These advances not only facilitated the exploitation of resources, but also enabled Homo sapiens to form larger, more organized social groups. Such social complexity could have overwhelmed other human species, either through direct conflict or by monopolizing critical resources. The extinction of Neanderthals, Denisovans, Homo floresiensis, Homo luzonensis, Homo naledi, and the Neanderthal-Denisovan hybrids marks a somber note in the symphony of human evolution. While these species once shared the earth with us, their legacies are now intertwined with our own, a reminder of the intricate and often fragile nature of existence. The story of these ancient cousins and their interactions with Homo sapiens underscores the complex dynamics of survival, competition and extinction that have shaped the course of human history. What do you think? If you found value in this video and want to stay updated with our latest content, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon so you don't miss out. We're eager to hear your feedback, so please leave a comment below and share your thoughts with us.